Gastric or stomodal or anterior sympathetic nerve system, the posterior sympathetic nerve system, and the caudal sympathetic nerve system. The somatogastric sympathetic nerve system it contains the frontal, hypocerebral, and ventricular ganglia. Along the end, a recurrent nerve and the nerves arising from these ganglia it innervates many stomodal and the dorsal vessel. It also innervates the midgut in some. Orthopteroid insects and the silkworm larva, the hypocerebral and the ventricular ganglia working in some insects. Yet the frontal ganglia is of the universal occurrence. The labrofrontal nerve, after arising from each of the two that's the frontal connective. The frontal connective run anteriorly and then the mid dorsal thorax is added. Just in front of the brain, terminating to the frontal ganglia. The labral vessels innervate the labrum. The frontal ganglion derived from its mid ventral part, a median recurrent nerve which runs in backward direction along the esophagus and Nervi corporis cardiacae and PC1 to 3 cardiaca corpora lata hypocerebral ganglia nervi corporis palati recurrent nerve and inguinal ganglia on these are the stomodal sympathetic nerve system nerves. Besides the excurrent nerve, the frontal ganglion gives a median motor procurrent nerve. Frontal nerve and or later in the cell. Sometimes the frontal ganglion is connected with the brain of the pulse, intercerebralis medial region by a median nerve connective with neuroptera, odonata, glatoidea, megaloptera, and diceptera. The hypocerebral ganglion lies in between the corpora cardiaca by the lateral nerve. The hypocerebral ganglion gives out the single or third nerves, the recurrent or esophageal nerve. These nerves run back to the cough and terminate into the ventricular ganglia. In Japix and termites, the number of esophageal nerves are three, each terminating independently in the ventricular ganglia. The ventricular ganglia give out a large number of high nerves which innervate the posterior part of the stomata. It never form a complex nerve in it over the stomata. The sympathetic ganglia exhibits similar type of histological organization described for the ventral ganglia. Each ganglion is composed of outer and ventral sheath, peripheral cortex and inner neurophile. The cortex bears the motor neuron bodies and some neurosecretory cells, the neurosecretory material of which runs along the recurrent nerve and finally discharged into the corpora cardiaca from which it is released into the blood. The neurophile of the frontal ganglion is divided into two halves. Anterior and posterior. The anterior neurophile is composed of cerebral origin which comes along the frontal connective. The posterior neurophile is composed of motor fibers and it is related with the recurrent nerve. The motor neurons are of various sizes. The sensory and motor nerve fibers run across the hypocerebral ganglia. The Arborization of fiber descended from the frontal ganglion. Neuropile of the hypocerebral ganglion does not contain the sensory axon or arborization. The posterior or ventral synaptic nerve system from each ganglion of the ventral nerve goes arises posteriorly a fine unpaired or median nerve running in anterior posterior direction. The median nerve arising from the ganglion runs for a short distance or terminally give off a pair of transverse nerves. The transverse nerve run laterally and innervate to the spiracle, segmental and ally muscles of the region. The median nerve gives out a dilation at or behind the site of bifurcation of the transverse nerve. 
the transverse in some insects also their fine ganglion photosynthetic fungus. The median and transverse nerves are the mixed type of nerve. Each median nerve contains two sets of axonal fibers, one set of motor fibers, while the other set of sensory fibers. Both of the sets contain equal number of fibers. As the median nerve bifurcates into two transverse nerves, the distribution of half number of both sets of fibers take place. So that is transverse nerve contain exact half number of motor and sensory fibers. So it is found that the motor fibers are the secretors the axons which terminate with their bulbous ending into the perisynaptic organs. The perisynaptic sympathetic organs therefore function as the neurohemal organs for the neurosecretory material secreted by the neurosecretory cells of the ventral in Locustra, a pair of median nerves arise from the metagrassi ganglia. The detailed study reveals that one represents a median nerve of metagrassi ganglia, while the other of the fused to first the abdominal ganglia. The transverse nerves in many insects are fused to the branch of dorsal nerve of the next posterior segment. In Coleoptera and Dictera, the ventral sympathetic nerve system is greatly reduced. In Debidoptera, the subicosagal ganglion does not share the median nerve. In Hymenoptera, the median and transverse nerves are totally lacking and the spiracles are enriched by the segmental nerves. The caudal sympathetic nerve system. The last abdominal ganglion gives off the caudal sympathetic nerve system. The nerves innervate the reproductive system, hindgut, medigut tubules, and the caudal part of the dorsal vessel. Some of the nerves are provided with the periosympathetic organs which act as the neurohemal organs for the neurosecretory material released by the neurosecretory cells of the last abdominal ganglia. The perisympathetic organs vary in structure and among different groups of insects and according to some scientists, they can be classified into various types representing phylogenetic and evolutionary status of the insects. The peripheral nerve system, some bipolar and multipolar neurons form a complex network beneath the integument above the segmental muscles and upon the surface of the gut. The distal process divide enormously over the innervated structure and their centri petal process are terminated into the central ganglia. An autonomous nerve system. Recently, SLAMA disclosed an existence of the autonomic parasympathetic like cholinergic nerve system, coleopulse system in the insects. It comprises cholinergic nerve fibers in thoracic ganglia, peripheral nerves with the metameric, perisympathetic, and neurohemal organs, and special groups of somatic or visceral muscles. It functions like a biological analog of an embryo electronic microprocessor. The coleopsile system is extremely sensitive to some neuropeptides, mostly to protocolin and other myotropic neurohormones. The coleoptile system regulates some important homeostatic physiological functions, regulation of hemolymph circulation through appendages, inspiration of air and expiration of circles through the spiracles, regulation of water balance and isosmosis. The next is neurobiochemistry and physiology, impulsive induction. Nerve impulses and their propagation along the axon are resulted due to changes in the conductance of the nerve membrane to Na plus and K plus ions. Na plus ions should be more concentrated outside than inside and more K plus ions inside than outside. The membrane depolarization is result due to opening of the ionic channels of the postsynaptic receptors due to binding of the transmitter molecule with the chemical synapse the membrane become more permeable to Na plus rising phase of the spike transient increase is followed by decrease in Na plus conductance associated with an increase in K plus conductance both activities initiates repolarizing phase of the action potential the presence of Na plus K plus stimulated ATPase activity and the Na plus K plus exchange pump in axon membrane has been reported in insects. Synaptic transmission in insects is facilitated by the following three systems. Cholinergic system. Acetylcholine 
the concentration of ACH in an insect ranges from 65 to 200 G inverse of tissue. It occurs 500 G inverse wet weight in the brain of California. Concentration of acetylcholine is therefore higher than that of the vertebrates and other invertebrates. Then choline called acetyl transferase CHA. It catalyzes synthesis of ACTH from acetate and choline. It has been detached, detected from the nervous system of various insects. Choline acetyl transferase. Okay. It has been detected from the nervous system of various insects. It activity ranges from 2 to 100 mg ACH. Synthesized to the inverse tissue. But our cholinergic system acetyl choline, choline acetyl transferase. Then Acetyl choline esterase. This system is responsible for the hydrolysis of ACH into choline and acetic acid. It is detected in the brain of various insects. It is highly active in insects. 130 to 180 mg ACH hydrolyzes G inverse tissue power inverse about 100 times higher than the cerebral cortex of the mouse. The esterase activity is very high and localized in the neurophile. It is also present in the cytoplasm of the postsynaptic neurons in the corpus pedungulator. The concentration of 2-ACHE increased greatly during metamorphosis and species-specific activity is affected by various factors such as pH, salt concentration and enzyme concentration. ACH receptors. There are specific receptor sites on the surface of postsynaptic membrane which allow interaction of ACH molecule. The ACH receptors are made up of two functional units. One is the respiration site binding ACH and the other one is ion channel which lets the ion move through the membrane down their electrochemical gradient. In the membranes, in the vertebrates, ACH receptors are of two types. Ganglionic receptors of autonomic nervous system and receptors at the neuromuscular junction which are activated by nicotine, nicotinic receptor and the ganglionic receptors activated by Muscarin, muscarin, muscarinic receptors. In insects, besides these two types, the third one, pupitum mixed ACH receptors are detected, which are activated by both nicotine and muscarin. Then glutenergic and GABA aminergic system. At the mus neuromuscular junction of insects, L glutamic acid and gamma abinoglutinic acid GABA are known to occur as the excitatory and the inhibited transmitters respectively. The glutamic acid is obtained from the Krebs cycle or from glutamine while GABA from the Krebs cycle but we have succinic acid and succinic semi-aldehyde or from, a, from glutamic acid. Glutamic acid and glutamate are detected from the nervous system of various insects and a constituent of the hemodymph amino acid pool. In sister circa, 53.3 mole gene verse dry weight glutamic acid and 5 mole gene verse dry weight of glutamine are detected from the head extracts. The glutamic acid decarboxylase, the GAD, the converting glutamic acid in GABA occur in relatively high concentration in some insects. GAD activity in insects is about 2.5 times greater than the mouse brain. Glutamate aspartate transaminase destroying glutamic acid has also been detected in various insects. There are specific different glutamate receptors in the muscle fibers, three junctional and two extra junctional receptors, glutamate, glutamine, and next three, glutamate, GABA. Then aminergic system. Biologically combined such as dopamine, noradrenaline, and adrenaline and serotonin are detected in the central somatogastric nervous system, neurohemologen, salivary glands, hyaminopterin, venom apparatus, and 5-HT in the hemocytes and cockroaches. Other biogenic amines such as triptamine, 5-methoxytryptamine, melatonin, and bufotronin are not found in insect nervous system or tissue. Catechol and Indolamines are located in various nervous structures in insects by the Hillark flax aldehyde fluorescence technique. The catecholamines are synthesized by tyrosine, while the indolamine from the tryptophan as follows. Octopamine acts as a modulator 
at the neuromuscular junction while dopamine and 5-HTSC neurotransmitters or neuromodulators in the CNS, visceral muscles and salivary glands. They more stimulate aldehyde cyclase activity and increase levels of cyclic AMP in the target cell. Role of neurotransmitters in insect acetylcholine, dopamine, octopamine, pyramine, 5-hydroxy, tryptamine, histamine, glutamate 4, amino butanoic acid, gamma amino butyric acid and a range of peptides are evaluated as neurotransmitters. Of the biogenic amines, the role of thyramine as the neurotransmitter is yet less convincing. The evidence supporting neurotransmitter roles for glutamate and gamma amino butyric acid at specific insect synapses is overwhelming. There are considerable differences between mammalian and insect biogenic amines and amino acid receptors. Although the number of insect neuropeptides isolated and identified has increased, particularly in recent years, only proctolin fulfills the criteria of neurotransmitter and the recent discovery of proctolin receptor agonists should enable the biology of the pentapeptide to be explored fully. Thank you.